Hello, my name is Olumi White Balaja B. It's so good to have you back on Scholarships Cafe. Um, if you're new on this channel, I just want to say welcome and uh, please do not hesitate to hit the subscribe button. And this is because in the next couple of days, months, and weeks, you'll be getting new content on this channel back to back and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for being part of our story in the last three years um do not hesitate to eat the like button today i'll be talking about opportunities as usual across the globe <laughs> Today, I'll be talking about opportunities across the globe. Like I mentioned earlier, um, we'll be addressing opportunities in the field of STEM, science, technology, engineering, and maths, as well as in the field of non-STEM, such as humanities, arts, education, and law. Um, I just want to mention once again that um, Scholarships Cafe is a platform that empowers students to find and apply for scholarships. We offer different consulting packages. In fact, we have a masterclass coming up on the 1st to the 3rd of February 2024. And you do not want to miss this. In the masterclass, we'll be talking about strategies to land opportunities with a 222 in first class and HND in 2024. And bonus, you're going to have like free CV review and then you can ask um, the opportunity to ask questions are uh, from me so today we'll be starting our journey uh, from Germany uh, so if you're looking for a fully funded PhD in economics uh, the Berlin School of Economics offers um, PhD opportunities um, for international students the application already opened November 2023 and it's going to close on the 11th of February uh, 2024. Um, there is a PhD track in accounting, finance and management. General aspect of doing a PhD in their program, they're going to have an online session which you can try to join on the 23rd of uh, uh, January 2024 from 12.30 to 13.45. CET. So if you're interested, you can join here. So for the requirement to, to enjoy the scholarship or to apply, you need to have a master's degree in economics or business studies and have exceptionally performed well in your study. Applicant from other fields such as industry, engineering, statistics, quantitative social sciences may also fulfill the admission requirements if they have sufficient background in economics or business studies. So if you're in the field of engineering, statistics, quantitative or uh, social sciences, you may also be qualified for the scholarship for GRE test. It is not mandatory, but it is uh, recommended. And um, the scholarship opportunity is, is quite comprehensive because in Germany, for instance, tuition is free. On top of that, the scholarship offers you stipends for uh, the duration of your program. To apply for the scholarship, you need a motivation letter, which must not be more than two pages. This should state your motivation for applying to the program and should include a brief outline of your research interests. Secondly, you need copies of academic transcript and certificate, detailed curriculum vitae here without photograph. Please do not include your photograph. Uh, if you're going to use the Europa CV, you can remove the photograph. Um, I've mentioned that GRE is not mandatory, but highly recommended. IATS or TOEFL score, if applicable to academic references, ensure that you talk to your references before you name them in your application. And your referees have to upload their references in the application portal until the application deadline, February 11. 2024. Once again, for tuition and fees, there are no tuition in Germany. Most institutions in Germany, Berlin School of Economics also provide you with funding for the expected length of your program. And also, um, they provide funding for dissertation phase. Uh, it's actually conditioned on having fulfilled the program performance or criteria. So if you are interested in a fully funded PhD in economics, in Germany, um, which is one of the biggest guys in Europe, I would suggest that you apply to the Berlin School of Economics, which the deadline is until February 11, 2024, 11.59 p.m. CET. Still in Germany, um, the Etter School 
Center for Digital uh, Governance offer two, three PhD, two, three years scholarships like you know um two opportunities for three year scholarships for exceptional students seeking to pursue full-time phd in the field of digital governance so if you're interested in digital governance if you've done something related to public policy digital governance i would suggest that you check this out it's also in berlin um you know the their doctor education provide rigorous academic training and many opportunities to engage with international experts and scholar from a wide range of disciplines and background so the inviting candidate with exceptional academic track records to apply so if you hold a master's in social sciences or other related fields to digital governance this is an opportunity for you the application deadline is still the 31st of January 2024 once again the Center for Digital Governance at the Actors School in Berlin is offering three years stipend for full-time PhD for two people, which start at the beginning of August 2024. International students are eligible to apply for uh, this opportunity. Once again, if you're new, welcome to Scholarships Cafe. Please subscribe. And if you're a returning subscriber, we we'll want to welcome you once again. Please hit the like button and also drop a comment uh, in the comment section. Still in Germany, um, let's move to um, Constructor University, which has a collaboration um, in Switzerland as well as in Bremen University uh, in Germany. One thing that is really good about this program, the master's program in computer science and software engineering is that they kind of give you flexibility. I know someone that had a background in microbiology and then had a work experience in tech and got to the scholarship to study fully funded in Switzerland. And now the colleague in Korea, which we met, we met in Korea, got this opportunity to also study at this university for free. So um, if you're interested in computer science and software engineering, you want to check out Constructor University. And one good thing about this university is that it's a master's of science degree from the German International University, free choice of study location, whether in Germany or Switzerland, direct access to EU and Swiss job market. Like if you have the opportunity to study in Europe, you have access to Schengen countries. You don't even need to apply for visa to visit about 25 Schengen countries. They offer scholarships, tuition defara, and also financial options. Talking about the application deadline, well, for 2024, I would assume for international applicant will be June 1 and for internet, for local applicant will be July of 15. And please ensure that you apply um, on time. And once again, full scholarship and financial aid is um, provided. For further information, you can contact the student recruitment master's degree, um, Ihana Donina for further details about you know maybe the scholarship for this year or when the application opens for this year once again if you're interested in master's program computer science and software engineering um check out the constructor university um, in bremen either in bremen university or in switzerland so people do say i talk more about phd masters i don't really talk about postdoc this is a good news for people in the field of sciences anyway uh no science and non-science uh, i shouldn't mix that up this is the humboldt research fellowship for postdoctoral research uh, uh, fellow as well as experienced researchers it allows you to to come to 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 do your research in germany you can stay up to 24 months and up to 18 months for the other one so let's just go through what it offers um the, the Humboldt Scholarship offers opportunity to conduct your own research at various stages of your career in collaboration with a host at a German research institution of your choice and you may also apply for a subsidy towards research cost for postdoc you will benefit from a research sponsorship in germany at the beginning of your academic career you will be able to conduct your research in germany and the monthly fellowship amount is about 2670 euro which the fellowship might last from six months to 24 months for experienced researchers you also have the opportunity to carry out your research in germany the fellowship amount is a bit higher than postdoc it's three thousand one hundred and seventy euro per month and fellowship may last from six months to 18 months and can be divided up to three stays within three years i i had two people that got this opportunity one came on the professor's funding and the other got this 
funding himself and he came to to germany an additional you know benefit is the fact that in, in for the financial support uh, uh you know kind of includes debt which covers your family uh, children and marital partners subsidies for private health insurance as well as allowance for travel expenses it is also applicable to apply for this program um, the application takes place March, July, and November every year. So if you're interested in this Ombuds Scholarship, the Ombuds Fellowship, I would suggest that you prepare your application now. Look for uh, host institution in Germany and apply accordingly. How to apply, it's on this page. So you also find the link to this um, fellowship in the description section of this video. So let's go to the UK. Uh, so many people do talk about um, looking for master's opportunity, especially in public health. At uh, the London School of Hygiene and Tropical Medicine, there are several opportunities that you can apply for. Um, we have the 2024 to 2025 Trust Master's Studentship, Public Health. We have the 2024 LST HTM First Generation Scholarship Distance Learning. We also have the Heli Application Fee Reduction UK Master's Student. Um, some are for home student and some are for overseas student and some are also for all. For instance, the 2024-2025 Bashir Zaba Memorial Scholarship covers Master's in Demography and Health, which eligibility status is for all students. The application closes on the 15th of April. Uh, 2024 we have the work on trust master student for home student we have the lshtm first generation scholarship for distant learning masters by distant learning in your home country um it covers every student and the deadline is on the 6th of april 2024 so you can click on any of this link to apply for the scholarship they also have phd scholarship so you can check this page they have opportunities for public health sexual health and health policy in um, whichever way that's kind of you know um you know relates to you and most importantly they encourage applications from black asians and ethnic minority and first generation students uh, to apply for the uh, fellowship still in the uk um, we'll move to swansea university this is a scholarship for chemical engineering student um, it's a fully funded eps rs and swansea university phd scholarship fluid dynamics of glacier sentiment the closing date is until the 26th of january 2024 and the program is expected to start on the 1st of october 2024 the phd is it's a program for three years to explore the complex flow behavior of glacier uh, sediment to be eligible you need at least a 2-1 um, level of an, or non-UK equivalent by Swansea University so you don't have the masters to apply for this opportunity and this opportunity is quite good because it's open to candidates of all nationality from international student and the funding provided will cover full cost of tuition and an annual stipend at UK higher rate currently 18,622 Pans. Um, you don't have to pay any, you know, difference between home students and international student. Again, if you have a degree in chemical engineering, this opportunity is for you. I would strongly recommend that you apply for this opportunity before the 26th of January uh, 20, uh, 24. You can go through the page to see how to apply, your choice of course, the start date, the funding page, uh, and also in the case whether you are funding yourself or you depend on funding. Still in the UK, uh, we're moving to University of Sheffield for those interested in public health. The European Master's Program in Public Health application is on. Uh, it's a two years double degree program funded by the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship. And this, this, this course draws on the expertise of eight European universities through a competitive application process, um, which offers scholarships and also self funding opportunity. In your first year, you will have uh, competence and public aid at either the University of Sheffield, University College Dublin, taught in English, University of Granada taught in Spanish, 
or the University of Liger taught in French. And in your second year, you would choose an expertise in the field of public health and practice at a consortium member university in France, the Netherlands, Poland, Belgium, or Spain, and also undertake a placement and dissertation. And at the end of the first year, you will join other students and study under three week integration models in Rennes. So if you complete your two years program, you receive a master's awarded by the university where the first year was studied, and you receive another master degree awarded by the university where the second year was studied. That means you get double masters. So um, if you're interested in public health, I would encourage you to check out the University of Sheffield um, European Masters Program in Public Health, which is funded by the Erasmus Mundus uh, Scholarship. Still in the UK, uh, we are at Kingston University in London. They have several PhD studentship opportunity for 2024. October 2024 start date and uh, you know your complete application must be received at the end of the day uh, GMT midnight Wednesday 6th March 2024 they have different scholarships from fully funded scholarship to raise equality studentship to Kingston alumni studentship to partial studentship to tuition for you on this scholarship so you can check this out for the fully funded scholar studentship they offer up to 15 awards own tuition own only for three years stipend for three years or six years part-time they also have raised equality studentship fully funded studentship for black asians and minority ethnic applicants they have the kingston alumni scholarship the partial scholarship up to five awards are available they also offer tuition fee only studentship again the application deadline is on the, till the 6th of March 2024. Each of those schools, you can click on it, each of those schools to see um, the research areas, the faculty member, and the kind of scholarships uh, they offer. I've received different questions from people interested, you know, in studying South Korea, and I would um, recommend this website um, which is called um, higrade.net um, so many professors post opportunity here and we will just take a look at one of the opportunities um, you should ensure that you translate your page um, on your computer so English could be in auto translate like here uh, they're recruiting grass in the Department of Food Science and Technology Dungia University and this recruitment is till the 30 at of January 2024, they're recruiting masters, doctorate, integrated masters and PhD. So you can do masters and PhD at the same time. Your resume, degree certificate and self-introduction is, is needed. Support details, living expenses, 40% reduction in tuition, opportunity to participate in conferences, payment of research allowance and payment of incentives when you submit our paper. So if you are interested in opportunities in South Korea, I strongly recommend that you bookmark this website and then check it daily and see whether there is an opportunity uh, in your field. For those interested in the field of maths, uh, the joint MSc Maths Mood, uh, Mathematical Modeling Engineering, it's a two years joint master's program run by three European universities in Italy, Germany and France. And this program it aims at satisfying the need of experts that may be able to apply rigorous mathematically modeling and computational techniques to solve problems in all areas um, of engineering. Uh, the deadline for the scholarship is until uh, February um, 29 at um, 1 p.m. Italy time. So if you have a degree in math and you're interested in uh, mathematical modeling engineering, I would suggest that you check out the Maths Mode Scholarship, which closes on the 29th of January uh, 2024. This is a scholarship which is jointly uh, funded by the Erasmus Mundus uh, Scholarship and um, it is applicable for students interested in the field of maths. Still in the field of maths, um, the masters, there's a master's in mathematical science application at Ames Rwanda. Um, the structure program runs over three semesters and I've had people that enjoy this program and afterwards they move to the US or you know the U or, or Europe to, to, to kind of um, you know take up another PhD or a PhD position 
classes are taught by renewed Africans, um, students and teachers cohabit in a perfect living environment. Um, you have 24 hours access to computer rooms and the internet. Why can't you apply for this scholarship? And um, there is no registration fee, uh, uh, you know, for this um, scholarship. Um, full scholarship covers tuition. They provide some accommodation, meals, and travel expenses. And guess what? The application is on until the 29th of March 2024. So if you're in the field of mathematical science, I would encourage you to um, apply for the Masters in Mathematical Science application at Ames Rwanda, which is currently open and it closes on the 29th of March of 2024. Moving to the Netherlands, there's an open call for applications for five fully funded uh, PhD position in the field of social sciences. Um, the goal of this recruitment is to have a diverse and exceptional cohort of candidates. Um, they're looking for ambitious and talented researcher with a passion for the craft of social science. So if you're in the field of social science, I would encourage you to please apply for this opportunity. Um, the applicant must have a master's degree or equivalent within the social science by September 1st, 2024. So if you're still in your master's program, you can apply for the scholarship. The benefits, it's a temporary employment contract of 38 hours per week for a maximum term of four years and you will get up to 2,770 hiro gross per month in your first year which increases to 3,539 hiro in the final year based on the full-time employment of 38 hours per week and keeping with the collective labor agreement of Dutch University. When does it close us? It closes on the 17th of March, 2024. Um, if you're looking for a fully funded PhD in social sciences, I would encourage you to apply for this open call for PhD candidate at the University of Amsterdam. It's open to international students. Um, if you're in the field of data science or do you're working on something related uh, to machine learning or you, you you know how to code but also in natural and social sciences you want to apply for this two-month fellowship program which starts on the 1st of August to September 30, 2024 it's a, it's a team two teams of four to five fellows each working on a project for the social good will be selected in person at LMU Munich in Germany the deadline to apply is 2nd of February 2024. Uh, the benefit is a full-time scholarship and accommodation for the duration of your fellowship. The scholarship was um, 1,400 hiro per month along up to 1,500 in compensation for travel costs. You have the accompanying the program. Um, you also have social events to interesting and impacted project to work on. So if, you work, if you're working uh, on data science as a PhD student, a master's student, or a bachelor student that is towards the end of your program, uh, please, it will be okay to apply uh, for this uh, DSSG uh, Munich 2024 uh, fellowship, which offers an opportunity for you to travel to Germany to stay for two months at LMU Munich uh, in Germany. Next, uh, I'll, I want to talk about uh, the Graduate Application International Network. So if you are a motivated individual that wants to pursue a PhD in economics, if you had already had a Bachelor of Master's degree in economics or related feed and you finish the top of your class um, and you're from Africa, uh, this um, Graduate Application International Network, it's something that you do not want to miss. Um, this supports you to apply to grad school, accepted application and we attend free bi-weekly webinar series where speakers will discuss different aspects of grad school admission and career in research or policy and after the series you will be matched um, with a mentor an experienced mentor to guide you through the grad school application process uh, to, for more information on the different phases of the program please see the about the page to apply for this program you have to have all the bachelor or master's degree in economics or related feed uh, you should be actively or looking for or you're seeking to pursue a PhD in economics or related field and you must be willing to travel abroad and commit the necessary time to participate in the game webinar uh, series you must be willing to study abroad and um, 
applicant must be willing to study abroad and commit the necessary time to participate in the GAIN webinar series. You must be able to dedicate three to five hours per week for the program from March uh, to December. So if you meet this qualification, um, you should apply until the March, until March 11, uh, 2024. Um, below or you can also click here uh, this is the form the google form here you have to state your name um, your email address your date of birth your gender your nationality where you're currently residing is degree completed gpa result which percentile did you graduate if you graduated with honors please say them below your university name uh, have you ever participated in the game um, program before and all the questions in the google form and then you submit on or before uh, the 11th of march uh, 20, uh, 24, and they are also going to have an information session on the 1st of february 2024 via zoom Okay, let's go to Netherlands again. We have the, the opportunities at Vanningen University. Uh, they have several scholarships which have always been seen. Um, you know, they have up to 34 available vacancies right now. Postdoc position assessing their hazard of nano and microplastic for humans. They have full professor position. PhD position in un unraveling plasma membrane structure in response to environmental stimuli. Uh, they have, you know, PhD position energy evaluation of feeds and ingredients for carnivorous fish. Fish PhD position energy evaluation of feeds and ingredients for low tropical uh, fish. And it, remember, they also offer the African uh, scholarship, which closes on the 1st of February uh, 2024. So there are several PhD positions, postdoc position, assistant position, PhD in machine learning for food safety, research AI for agriculture university. So you want to check out the vacancy section of um, Vanningen University. You might actually find something that matches with your area of interest. Oh, let's go to Austria. In Austria, there is this an Austria Development Corporation Scholarship for students from ADC parity countries or for and students from other developing countries. This scholarship is very interesting because this is the first time I'll see scholarship being awarded for diploma costs um, of the Institute of Tourism and Hotel Management. The diploma course includes a general module and a professional module and an elective. And um, the scholarship, um, you know, submission deadline for the scholarship is till the 1st of March 2024. 20, uh, and they give you tips for successful application as well. Um, for scholarship for ADC party countries, countries are it's limited to countries like Ethiopia, Uganda, Burkina Faso, Mozambique, Bhutan, Palestine Territory, Georgia, Armenia, Moldova. And this scholarship provides tuition, accommodation, flight ticket, health uh, insurance, food from Monday to Sunday, excursion, 205 euro pocket money per month. Um, not included visa is not included for scholarship for developing countries they also provide tuition health insurance food from monday to friday as caution 205 euro pocket money per month but they don't provide accommodation they don't provide flight ticket they, pro they don't provide visa fee and you should know that there's an age limit of 35 years for eligibility so if you're interested in the diploma costs uh something related to tourism and hotel management you might want to check out the scholarship in austria which uh, uh, the deadline to submit is the state of 1st of March uh, 2024. To apply, you can click apply now and you will also find the description uh, on this description section of this video, the link to apply for this scholarship. Coming to Canada, we have the International English Scholarship at the University of Ottawa. Uh, this scholarship was established last year, uh, to be precise, if I'm not mistaken, uh, the whole for entrance and excellence scholarship uh, for students from Africa, Indonesia, Vietnam, China, South Korea, India, Bangladesh, studying English and um, you know the university of ottawa it's part of its international diverse student body and you know they also um wants to uh, ensure that students from this country benefit from significant reduction in tuition fee when they study in one of the eligible undergraduate program offered in english note that this scholarship is applicable to undergraduate courses to be eligible you have to be from any country in africa or one of the country listed be newly admitted in fall 2024 time in one 
one of the eligible programs not enrolled in the French and Martian stream, have a you know valid study permit when class starts and be enrolled uh, full time. Uh, again, Africa, Indonesia, Bangladesh, Indonesia, or Vietnam, you will be automatically be eligible for an entrance or excellence renewable average based scholarship when you enroll in any of this program, including accounting, business technology, finance, uh, international management, civil engineering, chemical engineering, biology, biomedical sciences, geology, anthropology, uh, international economics and development, psychology, sociology, and all the programs listed here. So you can check this page to see the eligible programs. Let's check the scholarship amount by place of origin. If you are from you know, Africa, India, and Bangladesh, you can get scholarship up to $80,000 over four years, $20,000 per year. If you are studying the Telfer School of Management for Faculty of Engineering, you can get up to $100,000 over four years. Faculty of Health, you can get up to 70,000 over four years. Faculty of Science, you can get 70,000 over four years as well. So we have both excellence and entrance scholarship, which kind of uh, differ. If you're from Vietnam and Indonesia, for um, excellence scholarship, you can get up to $60,000 over four years. For entrance scholarship, you can get 20,000 over four years. Uh, China and South Korea, they have up to 20 uh, scholarships, excellence scholarship, which is like TELFA School of Management, 40,000 over four years. Faculty of Ed Science, 20,000 over four years. Faculty of Social Science, 20,000 over four years. So uh, I would encourage you to please check this page to uh, see the eligibility criteria and how you can apply for the scholarship at the University of Ottawa. Um, is one of the best institutions in Canada and you would not regret uh, making a choice to attend uh, the university. Uh, I just want to say thank you uh, for you know um, being part of Scholarships Cafe journey. If you are new on this channel, we welcome you to the community Community. make sure you hit the subscribe button and for our returning subscriber shout out to you for you know supporting us in the past years um, our masterclass opens on the first of uh, February to third of February and we will be dissecting strategies to win scholarships in 2024 and um, you know el the eligibility to participate in the masterclass is minimum of 2-2. HND is welcome. Uh, third class is also welcome. We provide you with strategies to win in scholarships in 2024 as well as a free CV uh, review and we're looking forward to being part of your story in 2024. Once again I want to encourage you please explore different opportunities that that we post every day on Scholarships Cafe and I wish you all the best in your applications. Till I see you the next time, please do not forget to drop your comment um, in the comment section. Hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't and also share the video with your friend. Uh, bye for now.